Are we ready to go? Light on set, the mole journey, light on gates open, away they go, and Artisone from the inside bounced out well. So did Island Dancer away well with Camogli. So El Sicario just allowed to find his feet slotting in a number one star still wide at this stage. So Artisane going to a roll he enjoys. That's the lead and he goes into that first turn at the 1300 metre mark at the length in front. Just wants to probably over race a touch. He's a length in front now of Camogli who's working around the outside of Island Dancer now as they just try and back the speed off. Island Dancer just getting on the steel a little bit also, just settles better. Now two lengths, number one star, who's not far off those, and El Sicario, the big fella's at the tail, and he looks like he wants to uh, get into a bit more room, and Wayne Davis just letting him easy up the back of that battle. So getting to the 8.50, and Artisone makes play, a half to Camogli the outside. They pass the eight. A length back on the inside then to Island Dancer. Number one star, it's outside, and El Sicario is going to have to come around him. He's back at the tail. So off the back, Camogli starting to serve it up to Artisone at the six. Goes away a length in front of Artisone now, who's pushed along. Island Dancer's trying to get off the rail, looks to do so from number one star. And now El Sicario starts to circle the field in style. So working to the 400 metre mark, and it's Camogli. He got to the lead before the turn. He's out by two. Island Dancer's coming on. El Sicario likewise is the one who's moved into the race nice. A gap out of zone and number one star, but Camogli Arnott took a peek over the shoulder. The big fella El Sicario runs on, and Island Dance is trying to get another go on. It's El Sicario Camogli. Island Dance is putting in, but Camogli's kicked like a good thing. He got clear close to home. Island Dance is coming with every stride, but Camogli wins it. A neck on the line to Island Dancer, who got close in the end. It's a stable Cornella. A gap El Sicario, he just didn't run it out, and then behind those number one star out of zone, the last one home. Camogli, number five. Vanessa Arnott in the white cap, holding off Island Dancer in the drive to the line with El Sicario, who loomed to win it coming around the turn. But just peaked on his run about the 150. He's been comfortably held to the drive to the line. Number one star, right his own well back. But Camogli put a good run on the board last time out behind Kowloon Kid. Prior to that, was a bit out of sorts, but last start was good. Got up to the mile this afternoon and uh, sat outside the leader Artisone, took over a fair way from home, so it was left in front there for the taking, but found plenty. Island Dancer came late, looked like it was going to get a, a real close Island Dancer, after looking like it was sort of dropped off before the turn, came again, and El Sicario uh, will hold the third down, and you'd have to say they all had their chance there. Five, three, one in 136.6. And... A long neck by one and three quarters the margin. Long neck, one and three quarters. Five Camogli. He's a four-year-old bay guilty, more than ready. Britta Mart for Lindsay Smith. Mr. P. W. Clayton. Mrs. J. T. Harry. Mr. F. Fitzgibbon. Mrs. G. Fitzgibbon. Mrs. T. Cross. Mr. S. D. Thomason. F and C Racing Pickled Mud Crabs Syndicate. And if you're not first, you're last <laughs> syndicate. It's the first time I've read that one out, but well done to Connections. And uh, Tayan hold of Vanessa Arnott, and uh, Tayan's got the result here with the Quinella. About to return, second going to Three Island Dancer, Five Roll Bay or Brown Gelding, Hinchin Brooks, she, uh, can she move for uh, Tayan Holder, Alice Lindsay, and third going to one El Sicario, a seven year old chestnut gelding, Bull Bars, Picker Picker for Paddy Johnston and Wayne Davis. But the winner returns, Camogli, win two from 17, had that one minor placing. And today's win takes his prize money up towards the $35,000 mark. And Camogli hitting a bit of form. It ran a really good race. First up behind Exact Replica. And really, its campaign's been good. It's, uh, it's probably run three really good races out of four this campaign and post the win this afternoon. We stand by for correct weight, folks, on race number five. Just uh, confirming that fourth. Fourth went to two, number one star, fifth to number four, and that was Artisan.